Hello everybody, um, it's us again. We um, wanted to keep posting almost on a daily basis on the feedback of patients we're getting, questions we're getting from people that are now, have been in quarantine two or three weeks and they're starting to show the effects of what people classically demonstrate after two or three weeks in quarantine. Crushing isolation, depression, inability to think clearly. Frayed they, nerve endings. <laughs> Frayed nerve endings. Uh, incredible appreciation for the role of teachers in their children's lives. You know, there's, <laughs> there is a lot going on right now and it's starting to manifest itself physically. And I want to say just a couple things to you, uh, people from the, pay, from the practice that I haven't seen in a while, and I'm not, I'm not going to see for a little bit. We are just now getting to the point where the tests are coming out in, in, in the scale that we need. You know, that, a little bit before last week, Private labs are now available to are, are now able to make tests and to distribute them. First time that's happened in quite some time. So now you're going to see a rapid increase in numbers. Now, not not everywhere, because there's a lot of cases out there of coronavirus that we don't know about. Now the testing will be there. So there's going to be a lot of up and down, especially in the next three or four weeks. So I want you guys to be prepared for that. Look at the cases. Do what we're supposed to be doing. Quarantine when you when when you have to. Don't leave unless you, I guess is what I'm trying to say when you have to. And I want to tell you this, just dig in. This is going to suck. It's going to be okay. Summer is still going to come. We're still going to get there. But I want you to understand that we are all having each other's backs in this situation. It's like the movie 300, you know, where they all lock their shields and you got, you know, 15, 20,000 Persians coming and they manage to hold them off because they all have each other. If one guy, maybe he didn't do his shield exercises that day or he thinks that shields are dumb and he throws his shield down, then like 10 dudes get killed. <laughs> and that's what this is like. Now, uh, maybe we don't look like we're in the movie 300 because those guys are pretty I mean, I feel like it. But I feel, right. I feel, I feel like that's where we're at. I feel like 299 of them. <laughs> that's right. So, but that's where we're at. It, this quarantine, this reduction of external uh, encounters only works if we all do it. Otherwise, we're going to be chasing this thing around the country all the way until ha Halloween. And nobody wants that. So every day we're going to have information for you guys in the practice that are staying at home on how to deal with your kids, how to stay mentally happy. We're going to continue that, but I wanted to take a break just to tell you, dig in. This is something that we absolutely have to do and that it will get better. All right, Dr. Matt, you have anything? Not really, other than uh, there will be light that comes and we'll be able to break yeah, the darkness. Sooner or later, sooner or later, you know? So if you have questions, specific questions about what to be doing at home, Call us, email us. There's a hundred thousand ways to get ahead of, to get a hold of us. If you uh, need something in particular, we're always available, even if we're not here. If you have an urgent case, if something's wrong, call Marissa or call Peggy. You know the numbers for our offices by now, or go on our website, and we're going to be dumping a lot of content onto the website as well. So probably you'll be able to get to these videos through the website. So um, we are still here, and we are rooting for you. All right, we will see you soon, Dr. Matt. Nice. See you later.